All right, we're leaving for LA in about two hours. It's two o'clock in the morning right now. We're just gonna stay up the whole time because there's no point in going to bed. Apparently Goten has very bad anxiety about, about flying. Tell him what happened. I had an emergency landing with Sun Country, so we don't fly Sun Country no more. Fuck Sun Country. But just kidding. Was, I had a good experience with Sun Country. I mean, that, I did too until that that one flight, literally. Like, We're flying Delta, bro. Delta kicked our ass off the airplane that one time. For real? <laughs> yeah. He's literally taking shots right now at 2 in the morning before he goes you. on. Because it was going to like calm his nerves. Now I feel you, Because I have like anxiety too in situations. And sometimes I'm a I'm an anxious drinker. Damn, he's pouring another one. <laughs> 2 in the morning. <laughs> Two down, probably six more to go. If it was like we drove, I'd be totally fine. You're fine. statistically way more likely to die in a car crash. Not to be the fucking nerd virgin that pulls that out of his ass. You know the fuck You're statistically, up, but you it's true. The, the first time I ever had a panic attack on a plane, bro, I just started like sweating. Like, like I literally had to climb over the dude in the in the aisle seat, bro. I was, like, <laughs> I was like, I didn't even tell him, watch out. I was like, <laughs> Snacks. See, I never take it because my bladder's so small that like I have to piss what? like the second I drink any. Bro, last time I ate an almond on an airplane, I thought I was gonna choke to death. Like for some reason, I don't know what it was, bro. The altitude made that shit like drier. <laughs> it was like clogging up my throat, bro. I, I ate the almond, I was like, the like fuck? on the plane, I was like trying not to choke, bro. Oh, no. And then I tried to, I, I like got it down finally. Uh -huh. I, I ate another one, same, same. shit. <laughs> Powerball is at 1.9 billion. Damn. I'm very against gambling. Like, don't get me wrong. That's the one thing that, like, I just do not do. I do not gamble, but it's at 1.9 billion. You know what I'm saying? Like, you kind of have to at this point. You know who gambles? Lefty. He was probably at the slots last night. If Lefty ever gets rich, you're gonna fucking see like a like a Netflix documentary about how he how he <laughs> like you know those <laughs> documentaries about the, the athletes that that get everything and lose it. Lefty's gonna be on one of those documentaries, bro. Yo, do you got a dollar? If I become a billionaire, I'll split it with you. Imagine I become a billionaire and you gave me a dollar, so I have to give you $500 million. Hey, if my homie lends me a dollar, I know he has a good heart, so I would gladly give up half of a half of a billion dollars. If we won this, bro, what would you do? Like I don't know. I don't know what I would do. I feel like I almost like wouldn't want to get that much money all at once. Cause like half of the thing that wakes me up like with a fire in my stomach. It's going out, it's going out and yeah, getting it, you know what I mean? Kiss the ticket, boys. Kiss it. <sighs> we won zero dollars. <sighs> Fuck! We didn't win. So a fan actually hit me up on Instagram. His name's David. I think he, he like owns like an Airbnb. And he just said that like we could stay there for free for the whole week. So now we're about to go meet up with him. Shout out to David though. 30 pictures per second. David, nice to meet you, man. Stand to nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, we're at this bougie-ass restaurant that. right now. This is the fanciest restaurant I think I've ever been to in my life. Lofi's first time trying lamb, guys. Took away his virginity right now. For real? How is it? Interesting. The most exotic meat I've ever had is probably like, turkey. <laughs> I haven't ever like ventured out. I've never had a cocktail in my life. These single moms might be onto something. The ones that drink cocktails and shit. Wow. Shit's fire. Come on, baby. Drive the boat. Let's get out to two fucking million. Two fucking million, guys. This guy puts in work. Go like you motherfuckers on YouTube with your fake ass friends. Couldn't have said it better myself. Uh, I see you working hard, bro. So for that one mil, bro, we, 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 got, we did something, bro. Oh, brother. Ooh. Damn, that's hard. It, it says one mil subs on the front. Too. He's so a big one mil guys. subs. Guys, I appreciate this guys, though for real. Guys, Thank you. Guys. He's an OG too. He said he's been watching since. What do you say? 115k subs. Yeah, damn. OG fan, man. I really appreciate it. All right. So this shoe store in LA called Cool Kicks invited us to go in. They said they they can hook me up with a free pair of shoes too, which would be dope. Cause I mean, look at my fucking. I wear the same slides every single day. It smells like a dispensary in here. It's like Air Force in your Nah, not Air Forces. I'm not a hot Cheeto girl, you know? <laughs> we got a legend in the building. We got legend. a legend. What's good, What's good, What's good brother? man? How you Real doing? legends. What's up? Tasha, got my mom. Mr. I like the chain. You like it, right? Cool we gotta, kicks. We got to get you one of these. I got to get one that says loaf. You do. You got to <laughs> get the branding right. What are you rocking today? The same Adidas slides I wear everywhere. Damn. Yeah. There's some damage in those. I know. I wear them everywhere. In the snow, too. I'm from Minnesota. And where'd you get that shirt from? 
Loafstore.com. Any words of advice for someone that's watching this video that's trying to get into the, the path that you took, like of making dope content and stuff? Be yourself and then consistency. And then, yeah, be yourself. Don't try to like, don't try to be something else because nice. you can't keep up that facade for very long, you know? Yeah, yeah. Especially in this like business, you'll get burnt out quick. No, 100%. So just do you, you know? Do you have a lot of sneakers in your collection or? No, nah, I don't have any. You don't have any? No. Nah. Damn. <laughs> Travis Scott sneakers. These are like 1500, these are 1400. 1400? God damn. Oh, Travis Scott sneakers are expensive. Damn. So the high top is like the, the my car is like that really? much. Yeah. I'm sure you're monetizing now with all the success. Are, yeah. are you investing? Like what do you what are you spending your money on? Yeah, now? I invest a lot. I try to save my money. I don't really spend my money. As you can tell, I just kind of wear whatever. That's, good. That's how the rich get richer. Yeah, yeah. Are you like crypto, NFTs? Are you into like real estate? Nah, like, I'm into the slow shit, index funds. Uh, Warren Buffett. Shout out Warren Buffett. <laughs> He taught me. And how old are you, if you don't mind me asking? 22. Damn, that's mm. young. You're young. That's yeah. dope. You got a bright future ahead. What's up with your love life? You got a girlfriend? You single? No girlfriend. No girlfriend. So, so you acting bad. <laughs> nah, I'm a virgin. What do you think about Yeezys? Oh, hell no. Nah. This looks like a like a net you catch fish in. <laughs> that's what it looks like to me. Does it not? It does. Has his sales declined at all? So Since White Lives Matter. So, so it's, it's, it's funny because we're the buy, sell, and trade business. So the day that all that thing happened, a lot yeah. of people were coming here to sell us shoes. Oh, shit. This isn't a mirror? Nah. Oh, shit. I thought this was a mirror. It was like an optical illusion. Okay, I'm liking these. Like those? Yeah, yeah. A, yeah. Have you ever played basketball before? Just like with my friends. What sport did you play growing up? Hockey. Hockey? 14 Thanks. years. All right, so I'm going to give you a chance to win these for free. All you got to do is make two feet throws in a row. Two you free get one throws. practice shot. It's a practice shot. God damn. Come on. That shit. It's gotta be the slippers. Give him the Jordan. Let him win the Jordan. If he makes these two feet throws all of a sudden, Jordan jumped over Adidas. So this feels better now. Jordan was a secret. Nah. God damn. You wanna uh, wear those out? Am I gonna get robbed? Nah, <laughs> you never know though. LA's uh, wild lately. Even though he missed the free throws, I blessed him those pair of shoes. Just because I love his videos and I love how you be moving. Thank Which you so much, bro. Yeah. Good luck with everything. Thanks what for having us. I feel like I gotta yeah. put the slides back on, bro. I feel like I'm gonna get fucking robbed out here. Hey, 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 hey. 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 Oh, it's good. He does paid videos. How much is it? No, I got through her. You're her, you're her, his, his yeah, manager? manager. Alright, bro. See ya. I'll do it for you. No, no, that's okay. I just didn't know. I was gonna give him money. I just wanted you to sell me how much. Oh, where's my pepper spray? I just want. Oh, hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Oh, shit. Look at, look at, look at, look at. These nuts. Oh, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I wanted to give him cash, but she said he takes paid videos. I, ha I said, how much? She didn't answer. Can I get a picture? Yeah, yeah. You know the guy that said D's nuts? Yep. He just chased us. Right. I'm out of breath, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, bro. Videos, bro. Thanks, man. Mm, Appreciate it. Can I have an airhead? An air? Oh, yeah, yeah, sure. Hell yeah, bro. I seen you on TikTok, bro. Oh, really? Yeah. Can I have an airhead? Yeah, yeah, fucking right. Thanks, brother. You want the fuck? Give me, let me get the bag. Oh, shit. Are you good? <laughs> I'm just playing. Have a good one, Thanks, bro. <laughs> Hey, 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 can you help us? Mickey, can you help us? We weren't even talking to him. Which one y'all want to get down? We're not filming you. Want to get down, We're walking this way. Is it true? Do you want to get down? Come on, bro. Bro, bro, bro. Which one y'all want to get down, bro? Relax. Relax. Don't touch it. Don't touch what? So who want to get down? Nigga, I just actually don't film me. Y'all niggas don't got no respect? Y'all have no respect? We weren't even trying to do Don't film me, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. 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 Hey, Bro, I don't know what just happened. Literally, look at Dan though. Dan looks like he just threw, went through a war, bro. Look at this shirt. They ripped his shirt. shirt. Bro, they, they ripped his shirt up. Chain, right? So this is what happened. Dan got jumped, so they grabbed onto Dan. So I went in, I grabbed the dude's arms, the guy in the white shirt, and then I was standing like facing this way and somebody fucking sucker punched me from behind yeah, right here. Yeah, I seen him. I wasn't looking, he came up behind me and hit me like bro. this. All of a sudden I looked around, bro, there was bro, six of them standing bro. there. Everybody that comments all the time like, you should get your ass beat for this. 
There you go, guys. They're gonna be rejoicing. They're gonna be on on the screen like I'm, it's I'm, about I'm, fucking time. I just don't get like why he got so mad though. We were walking by with the camera. We were we didn't say anything to them. And they're out here like selling mixtapes and shit. You're so scared of a camera. That's how you promote your shit these days. Can I take a picture? So yeah, are you gonna hit me? Fuck. I be watching your shit all the time. You guys just got done? Yeah. Go beat his ass for me though, okay? Gotcha. I'll have this one beat yeah, his ass. Yeah, have him beat this his ass. He looks mad. He, he knows He's something. Ready for Hell yeah. Say fuck them. <laughs> it was nice to meet you, man. They always try to go after Dan because Dan can't defend himself. He was grabbing Dan and I was like on his back trying to pull him off. And then from behind, somebody yeah. smacked me. I know, I know what the sign says, but he got he got jumped. Are you mad about the video or are you mad about the shirt? Both? We had to record it because somebody just jumped us. They beat his ass and ripped his shirt off. So we had to record it for the police. We are required to by law. It's for his parole officer. It's like killing someone, kicking dirt on their grave. <laughs> he gets his shirt ripped off, his ass beat, and then they say, "Oh, you can't come in here without a shirt to buy a water." If you show showing love, then you cool with me. I'm the same old dude before the jewelry, and everything kind of new to me. Things ain't nothing like they used to be.